Hi everyone. Welcome to another Tech Tips channel. Today we will continue the part 3 of the workshop for the dispatch module. If you haven't watched part 1, I highly recommend that you may watch it first. The link is shared at the top right corner. Alright, let's start the topic today, the pickup list and the delivery list. The data setting is shared in the part 2 video. The video link is shared at the top right. So now, let's check out the user interface for the pickup list. Pickup list data is sourced from the job to be pickup slice. Just set it as shown. Next, let's check out the detail view. This is the detail view. This view is auto created. And we just need to set the column order. For the pickup list, we have create an action. The pickup job action. Let's check out what it do. The action is referenced to the job master table with an action of open a form to edit this row. While for the appearance, set a relevant icon and set it as display prominently. And this action only will be enabled if the status is equal to pick up. Let's check out the form that opened by this action. Set the form as shown. And lastly, add an event actions and behavior. Let's check out what this action do. It is a group action, which will update the job status and date. And update the delivery member current location. And in the appearance, set a relevant icon and set as do not display. Let's check out the pickup job by and date action. Basically, this action will update three columns in the row. It set the out by with the current login user, set the out date as current date time, and it also update the status as out of delivery. Then, set the appearance as do not display. So this is the action, next, let's check out the update team current location action. The update team current location action is calling the action from the team table. With a condition of email column is same as current login email. Then it will run the update current location from the team table. Then set the appearance as do not display. Alright, let's check out the update current location action. This action is very simple. It will update the matched records current location with here. Then set the appearance as do not display. Alright, let's check out the next view, the delivery list. Set the delivery list as shown.
Next, let's check out the detail view. Set the detail view as shown. For the delivery list, we have created an action. The deliver job action. This action is to open a form to edit this row. Next, set a relevant icon and set it as display prominently. Then enable this action if status is equal to out of delivery. Let's check out the form. Set the form as shown. Lastly, set the event actions. Let's check out what this action do. It is a group action. It update the job status and the delivery member location. Then set the appearance as do not display. Alright, let's check out what the first action do. The first action is set the values of some columns in this row. It set the received date as now and status as delivered. Then set the appearance as do not display. For the next action, we are using the same action that we created for pickup list, the update team current location. All right, we have completed our workshop today. Next video, we will go through the format rules and the automation of notification. See you guys in the next video. Bye.